all right so chat like this guy he's got 20 hours right so his review i'll respect it 10 hours yeah let's read what he says i've sunk some time into it he did 10 hours okay so he's complaining there's no chat which is you know that's a good complaint Dude, was, oh my god. Well, at least he wrote a full review. So that's fine. This guy's 34, 18. That's yeah, fine. But, like, these people, dude, 1.4 hours. One point one hours. So at least he gave it a try. He says it was disappointing. The early access game were more developed than this. I mean, yeah, they like they they shouldn't have been released this as a full game. That's kind of grimy. Uh, right, like he said here, if it was released as early access, right? Yep. Uh, yeah, that, that, I don't, like, nobody cares about character customization. Go play GTA, you fucking loser. Uh, the driving, yeah, the driving's pretty bad. Uh, made by, like, a 12-year-old coder. Uh, but yeah, it's not a driving game. Oily. That's the first time I heard that. But, I mean, he still complains about the water. And he only played like an hour and then there's this guy who played an hour uh graphics look horrible this guy must play on like a toaster right uh, yeah, i don't i don't know he must play on a shitty pc this guy is four hours the water oh my god dude that's literally like i don't need to read any more past that yeah, that's a bit of an exaggeration. Worst game I've ever played? I don't know, dude. What up, Jim? How's it going tonight? Uh, yeah, here we go. Another another complaint. This guy played like 10 fucking minutes. And, like, he should, his opinion shouldn't matter. He shouldn't be allowed to have a review. Like, these people are killing the game. The peop All these people who have no time played leaving negative reviews and comments on the Discord and Reddit like complaining about the water you are killing the game like the devs are working on the water because all of you are complaining about the water like y'all are fucking dumb like if you want the game to be better complain about actual issues they forgot the early action yeah okay so i i just like he didn't really say more than that but he only has six hours so i mean but i do agree with his opinion but he's still like six hours that's you know let's do another four uh, yeah, I don't know. Mold, yeah. The salty boy. And then here's another one. 0.8 hours, dude. That's that's a yikers. What is that? 40 minutes? 30 minutes? At least he doesn't bitch about the water. He compares it to RF4 and Fishing Planet, though. Which is understandable... Because, like, when those games released in Alpha, they had more content. So, he is right. They had a lot more content now that I think about it. Uh, 1.3 hours. Uh, let's see. It's, it's almost impossible to believe this game is created by Expansive Worlds. Facts. I, I agree. I, like, I, 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 yeah. And, because I, you know... The Hunter, the whole whole another game, pretty much. And then, yeah, I mean, he goes on the bitch about the water, though. Like, if that's his only gripe is the water, then he shouldn't be allowed to, you know, fuck his review. Remove it. Delete it. Here you go. 0.5 hours. Yep, just getting a refund. Look, he didn't even get a refund. Get fucked. Uh, yeah, so another complaint that's not even fucking like hour it's like a half hour played and he's like oh the water 
Like, dude, like, I swear these people have never looked at another fishing game. And you notice the people who mention other fishing games, like, don't complain about the water, right? You do realize that, right? Like, all the people who, compl like, this guy, he didn't complain about the water. Because guess what? He played other fishing simulators. And the water is, is literally more trash than angler. That's what I'm trying to convince. Like, I, like, I'm just so fucking baffled by these trash reviews. Like I, I like I would like I, I, like can I see like can I see what this fucking idiot yeah private of course it's private you fucking lose he's probably never played another fishing simulator yo what up boys I just want to take a second to remind you guys to subscribe to the channel and hit that like button if you got any comments leave them below and I'll get back to you appreciate it and anyway, let's get back to the video Uh, let's see what this guy says. He's got 0.4 hours played, which is like, I don't know, not, e not even 30. It's like 20 minutes. Uh, huge step down from the Hunter. Feels like you're playing an Alpha. Okay, I agree with that. It, does, it feels like we're playing a Beta. Or Alpha, whatever. The environment, what, that's, I don't know what he's talking about there. The land is so big. What, what are you talking about? And then here we go with the water look bad again. Vegetation coverage is, dude, like, are these, like, bots leaving these fucking reports with 0.7 hours? Like, get the fuck out of here, dude. Alright, this one's got almost four hours. Okay, early access, we agreed to that. Uh, okay, maybe. Maybe I agree with the first part, maybe. Not really, though. I still got, you know, at least minimum 30 hour play. Uh... Yeah, Steam should have this to five hours. That way you can leave an actual decent review for a game. Uh, oh, this guy got a refund after two hours played. Wait, what? How do you... Wait, did, so did he refund it and buy it again? Like, I'm so confused here. What? How, what? Yeah, see, it's not, though. So, like, the game's not developed by this. It's not the same developer. Like, they should make that very clear in, like, the store page, the Discord, and Reddit. Like, they should make that extremely clear that it's a new, brand new dev team making this game. Like, I wouldn't put any flack on the Hunter. Like, that's fucked up. Uh, game seems to be focused on exploration. Yeah, I, I do agree. I don't like the stupid quest where it's like, go do, you know, go find this. Like, you know, like, the quest should all be focused on fishing. So I do agree with this, too. Right? Uh, right, right. Fishing game. Uh, yeah, so, yeah, we need more actual content. And stop nerfing bite rates. Like, hello? We want fish. Like, dude, I'm literally standing here with my line in the water, by the way, while I'm recording this. Like, literally fishing, not catching anything. Literally. Here, I'll recast, and then we'll keep reading. Alright, so back to our story mode. Like. Yeah, so stop removing content, aka nerfing bite rates, until you add more fish species, right? Add more equipment than cosmetics, like he's saying right here. Oh, look, a fish. Oh, no, I missed it. Oh, no. See, at least this guy wrote, like, a full review. And he's touching on a lot of points that I mentioned. Uh, I don't know if it's going to be a cash grab. I hope it's not. I, I really feel it's not because it's expansive worlds and I don't think they'll let their dev team get away with that I think they'll force them to either fix like add stuff and like uh, you know actually start working on the game instead of the water uh, okay you can be disappointed that's your you know whatever it's fine uh, guy says long rant he didn't even write a paragraph just what what 
What the f like fuck this guy's review. Your opinion shit. Sh shenanigans, of course. Get your shenanigan ass out of here. All the boys are down to fuck, so we decided to hook up and pump our rods together. <laughs> That's actually pretty funny. Uh Okay. See, this is what I think. Like, you're still gonna get your money out of it. Uh, it's not unplayable. The water looks fine on release. Yeah, I get. I I I have been crashing today. We got a couple crashes already today. I never had progress lost. Uh, yeah, I mean, bro, you should have learned. Like, if you're a big fan of the hunter, why didn't you back your files up? Pretty brain dead. Should have learned your lesson in the first game. Oh, we caught it. Hold on, fish. I gotta switch screens. You know, because in real life, you can just let go of your rod and everything, and you're fine. The fish is hooked. This better be a catfish. Interrupt us reading the reviews. Yeah, so what I'm trying to say about the reviews is there's too many people with stupid fucking opinions about the water who leave negative reviews. And most of those people only play the game for less than an hour. You know what I mean? Like, why should they be allowed to review the game with only an hour play? Right? That doesn't make sense. That, to me, that's like slandering somebody. That's like if I said, you know, like, you know, something about bad boys that's not true, right? Like if I said he was a racist or something, right? Uh, that's slandering him, right? Like, I, you know, that's, that's, you're not allowed to do that, right? So what I'm saying is Steam should make it so you cannot leave a review unless you have like 20 hours played in the game. And then they need to just up their return policy. But like anybody with under like 10 hours that leaves like a review about the water they can literally suck my nuts they they are the ones killing the game by the way they are taking the devs attention off the true issues of the game you know the content the lack of tackle box lack of chat etc etc uh hi that's fucking clock in the game you know what i mean like Maybe I'm wrong. Chat, do you not agree? Like, y'all being pretty quiet. So. Uh, 